Review, Hunter's Revenge, by Faith Summers. Description. My monster. My hunter. My husband. It all started with a chance meeting in a bar that was almost normal. I was drowning my sorrows, and he was the deadly handsome mysterious stranger who walked in. He had that dangerous air about him I was always warned to stay away from, yet like a moth to a flame I was captivated by his charm. All it took was one touch and I couldn't resist. When I'm with him, he consumes me and our passion is enthralling. Little did I know that behind Malik Volkova's fairy tale prince, Smile, lurks a monster. A monster who belongs to the Knights, a notorious secret society. And we only met because he was actually hunting me. By the time I find out who he really is, it's too late, and he unearthed my biggest secret. Out for revenge on the cartel, he forces me into a twisted arrangement for my hand in marriage. But our union drags me into a war and deeper into his obsession. Soon it becomes clear there's something he wants more than revenge, me. But I'm not sure if he'll be my destruction or my savior. My opinion. I received a free copy in exchange for an honest review. Hunter's Revenge, by Faith Summers, is a Bratva romance. It's the third book from the Savage Legacy series. This one is about Malik Volkova and Gwen St. James. For six years, Malik was hunting down the men that took him captive, tortured him for almost a year, and killed his captain. Since the person who orchestrated everything died, he found another way to serve his punishment. He was going to get their cartel, but in order to do that he had to find the daughter of the one who founded the cartel. It took him a long time, but he found her Gwen St. James had big dreams that went down the drain the moment her grandma got very sick. She dreamed of having her own store in a big city with the help of her best friend. Unfortunately for now, she had to stay back home, run the restaurant, and design lingerie for her online shop. Like this wasn't enough, she ended up paying a debt to a mafia guy that didn't belong to her. Gwen's life had turned into a nightmare. Then Malik appeared like a dark angel and helped her out. Then one night, everything changed. She realized the real reason he had approached her. She got played and it hurt. For six months, they had to be married and then she would be back to her normal life. Seemed like an easy plan, but it wasn't. This is such a great book. A true dark Brava romance, filled with suspense, hot steamy scenes, and bloodbath. The plot is engaging and capturing. I loved the mysterious way in the beginning and how slowly it became more heated. The mafia dealings were the icing on the cake for me. I love it when the guys go into protective mode and then show their true feelings.